Russia completed the production of the nuclear-capable Poseidon torpedoes. Russia has completed the production of the first batch of nuclear-capable Poseidon torpedoes. This report circulated by the TASS news agency. The torpedoes are scheduled to be delivered to the Russian Navy's Belgorod submarine, the world's largest. The news comes close on the heels of another report of Russian supremacy in arms and ammunition after the military declared that it was sending its Sirkon hypersonic missile to combat service to the Atlantic and Indian Oceans. As an arms supplier to a large number of countries, Russia is considered to be at the forefront of weapons technology. However, its claims have appeared hollow during the nearly year-long invasion of Ukraine since its advances have been cut down by arms supplied by the West. In such an environment, the news about a new torpedo can easily be waved off as another Russian exaggeration. However, the design of the Poseidon isn't meant for naval warfare alone. With capabilities of carrying a nuclear power plant, the Poseidon is a much feared weapon and is therefore among the list of super weapons that President Vladimir Putin has spoken about in the past. A product from the Rubin Design Bureau, the largest submarine design center in Russia, the Poseidon was developed under the codename Status-6 at a length of 65.6 feet or 20 meters and with a 15 megawatt nuclear powered engine, the Poseidon is larger than just a torpedo and assumes the form of an unmanned underwater vehicle, UUV, that can be launched from a submarine. The Poseidon is meant to attack coastal installations and can be equipped with a nuclear warhead that can avoid existing missile defense systems. Apart from unleashing thermonuclear destruction, Poseidon's warhead is also designed to spread the radioactive contamination over a wide area.